Oh my god. This is terrible. Deborah, we're under a, a tornado watch until 10 o'clock this evening. Uh, Brooks and I have been tracking uh, all afternoon. I uh, want to keep all safe and we're all to depend on us here in the Fox 35 Storm Center. Brooks, uh, interesting weather scenario this afternoon, to say the least. This is crazy. I just finished getting all the ducks in. Thank God I got them in the screen enclosure. Otherwise, they would probably be knocked out right now. This is all ice. Hail. It's hailing like crazy. I don't even know what to say. That is all hail. All the, look at the grass. Look at the lawn. This is insane. I don't even know what to say right now. Everything is destroyed. It's put holes in my windows. That is all ice. I gotta share this with you. I've never seen anything like this in all my life of living in Florida. I don't think anyone has. This is crazy. I, it, it's so much ice, it's gonna, it's gonna make the screen collapse. Look at the pond right now. It's steaming. It's like a giant ice bath. They put a giant hole in my window. Look at the roof. All that hail. Oh my gosh. This isn't good. I don't know why I'm laughing. Oh my. Well, it is over, but look at how much ice piled up on the screen here. It did do some damage. We got a broken screen right there, a broken window, and then our cars got pretty messed up. I haven't really checked them, but we'll see. But I mean, that's unbelievable how much ice is on this screen right now. I mean, there's probably a thousand pounds and it's just sitting there. It's not even really melting. So I just received some very, very unfortunate news. A lot of you guys know Andy, also known as Aquarium Shop. We make a ton of videos at his place. He's been local here for about the past five years and has been absolutely crushing it since he's opened up. With that storm, a bunch of tornadoes came through and it hit his place and absolutely destroyed it. I mean, I've seen pictures and videos so far. It didn't look so good, but we're gonna go check it out and see what we can help with. Giant trees. Look at that, guys. Holy cow. Oh my gosh, look at that thing. Wow, this is insane. I mean, there's trees everywhere. Look at these billboard signs completely down. This was no small tornado, I'll tell you that right now. Look at all of that stuff. It just collapsed, completely collapsed, and Andy's is right behind this. So that means it must have gotten hit hard. Holy cow. No. Look at the bank. Yeah, tornado must have came right through here. Yep, it did. Oh my gosh. There's Andy's. We got holes through the windows. Holy cow. I literally don't even know what to say right now. This is insane. I mean, the windows are completely busted out there. Look at the destruction this tornado caused. You got people just like going through all their stuff. Pieces of that roof flew off. Probably is what caused the holes in the window here. Got that fence down. Oh my gosh. Andy, what's going on, man? How's it going? Oh my God, were you here through this all? No, I wasn't here. Jeez. I got leaves in fish tanks. I got tile, bare roof tile from across the street in my coral tank. Oh my God, this is terrible. We got generators. They fired up generators last night running, and uh, they're like, "Dude, you want to scoop out all these leaves? I've got like tree limbs and branches in my tank." Once those shattered, all that wind was probably just gushing in here. Yeah, cracked my front tank, broke my front tank. I saw that, that's All terrible. The, uh, there is so much tile in here. That's a piece of glass from, the from one of the tanks. So imagine that, we're even a tile flying through that window and hitting you at like 100 miles per hour. There's the big centerpiece tank that Andy's had since he's opened up. It was like the main aquarium in the shop. Unfortunately, it got taken by the tornado. 
So these are houses right next to aquarium shop. Just to give you an idea of how much damage this did, there is a branch going through their house. Trees are absolutely destroyed. Look at the size of these trees. I mean, they've probably been here for 40 plus years. I want to give you guys this to help out a bit with everything. Thank you so much. You're welcome. Thank you. Well, that is really unfortunate news. I mean, we just have to help Andy out as much as possible. So what I'm gonna do is have a GoFundMe in my description down below. Click that link, it will direct you right to the GoFundMe. Thank you all for any bit of support. Andy really appreciates it. This was a really tragic event, so my prayers go out to anyone that was affected by this as well in the area, and I'll keep you guys updated throughout the process.